but in the lab one and lab two, so the first two labs, very straightforward, they're very uh, typical anatomy lab. So your job is you, you use your textbook, your, uh, your PowerPoint, and be familiar with those terminology. So in the lab you found, uh, it's, your lab is mainly you are the driver. I'm just here to help you. So I will give you a very small uh, introduction and you study those material. So the first two labs, very typical anatomy lab. So your job is study those terminology, be familiar with those terminology. We talk about them in the class. Superior, inferior, I'm gonna give you two body parts and you need to be able to tell me, okay, which one is superior, which one is inferior, or all the others. And these are the uh, plain sections, we talk about them in the class. So these different sections, mainly three, right? We have the sagittal, we have the Corona, we have the transverse, and we also have the mid sagittal, also for the medium, cut the body equal to the left and right. So I'm going to give you a model and give you a section, and you tell me what's the correct name of this section. And these are the body cavities, so you need to be able to tell me correctly what's this cavity. And these are the pleural cavity, cover the the lungs and pericardium cover the heart and peritoneum cover all the organ in abdominal pelvic cavity. So you need to be familiar with them. And let's look at the lab two. So in lab two, you study those terminologies. We talk about four different quadrants. I can point one and in the lab practical, you need to be able to uh, spell it correctly. So tell me, okay, I'm gonna point at that, that area. You tell me, okay, that's what quadrants. And also, I'm gonna ask you nine different regions. So be careful in the lab. I'm gonna ask you, I'm asking you the quadrant. So tell me the quadrant or I ask you the region in the nine different region. You're gonna tell me those nine different region. And these are the different body parts, their official name. So I'm going to ask you the official name. Like what's the official name of your chest? It's called the thoracic. And what's the official name of your armpit? You're going to tell me this armpit. You, can t you, you have to tell me this is called the axillary. So these are the official names. Use your textbook. So again, in the lab, you are the driver. So you need to spend time to study them. Okay, this these two labs.